Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I just did a video on this number it and how cool it is by Laser Jumpstart. But this is not so much about this program; it is about Corel. To make this work and make the numbers on a text to path, your number here has to be text to path, so it will stay on that path. So we're going to go to number. This time I did change the word to gear just for the fun of it. And I hit go and it's going to change all those numbers to paths. Now, but what I didn't think about in the previous video is if you were going to cut these parts out and engrave them, you're going to have a text to path and you're going to have a hairline or even if you didn't use a hairline, that's going to cut out and that's unacceptable. So what I did, I, I remembered what the, the inner part is 1.44 inches. So what I did, I selected everything, control K to break everything apart. Then instead of going through there and deleting each individual circle to get it right, Let's just put that back for a second. Go to edit, find and replace, find objects, begin new search. We want to find ellipses. Next. Let's try this again. Edit, find and replace, find objects. Next. Ellipses. Next, I didn't hit the, the ellipse. Specify properties. We're going to make the width 1.44. Okay, next, finish. Find all. And then when that finds it all, just X out of this. My computer is a little slow this morning. And there's a lot of them. But if you have a faster computer, and and, uh, and it also would be a lot faster than you could find them all. But it found them all. It, it might have done that before. I just wasn't ready. I guess I shouldn't have clicked off that. And I'm just going to hit delete. It deleted all those circles or those ellipses of that size. So now this is ready to engrave and cut out if that's what you're going to do. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.